Whenever I see a sunset, I am inspired to realize that our life will not go on forever. And it is not just about death. No, it is about celebrating life. We don't realize that life is a beautiful gift. And we think that we human beings are like machines. But have you ever seen a brand new Mercedes Benz or a BMW fail? The engine fail? No, it doesn't happen. How come a man-made engine doesn't fail, but a God-made life fails? It's not about being man-made or God-made. We don't realize that the power of life is divine. The power of life depends on karma. And the sunset should inspire us. Inspire us to realize that two things we don't decide. We don't decide our birth, the sunrise. We don't decide our death, the sunset. These are decided by karma. But we don't realize it. We drive a car, but we don't realize that this car is a machine. If it breaks down, you can put a new engine, change the car, start driving again. But if your life breaks down, can you put life back into your life, into you, into your life on earth? You can't. Today I read, a doctor was talking about how an IIT is trying to make artificial heart. They're trying to make an artificial heart, but we are not taking a moment to think of the one who made the real one, who created these 8 billion hearts, who's creating human beings, animals, birds, fish. You know, in this ocean, millions of fish. Today I was able to see some beautiful dolphins jumping. They were flying fish that came out of this water, flying like birds and then going back into the water. They are Pale, sharp, colorful fish. Do we stop to think each of them has a life? We're trying to make an artificial heart. When are we going to stop to realize the beauty of this human computer, the man machine? When are we going to realize that we are not this machine that we seem to be? We are the soul, the spark of unique life. It appears not on our birthday, but nine months before when we were conceived in the womb of our mother, we were born then. One day people would say, he passed away. And then they would look at the sky and they would cry and they would ask, why? It is a fact, isn't it? That anybody who is born must die. When will we stop to find out who am I? I am not this body that will die. Death is just a bend of the end. Either I will be liberated and united with the divine, or if I live with ignorance, the body will die and me, the mind and ego, will carry its karma and it will be reborn on earth in new birth. Let the sunset inspire us to value this life. Yesterday, somebody known to me, 35 years old, bleeding in the brain. Any moment, the person will die. In the next moment, the bleeding stopped and the life was saved. And we played the doctors. Little did we realize we get the doctors somewhere above, somewhere that exists everywhere. But we have been taught lies that God lives in the sky. So we think there's a God somewhere there. We don't realize that God lives in the temple of our heart. When will we realize that? When will we appreciate life? When will we value this gift of human life? And we must go in quest to realize that I am the divine soul, that spark of unique life comes and goes. Sunset should inspire us to live.